This it? Yeah. So how are we supposed to get topside? Through here. Then you're telling me we're not done? Sorry, guys. But it's not that simple. No! Wait! We gotta catch him! Huh? He took the key to the door! Without it, we're screwed! Let's go. Bastard went that way! Get your ass out of here! Much better. Need my help, please. Yeah. Uh, 
Keep those gloves up. Sure thing, coach. Just days. Take the right. I'm on it! Your days are numbered, rat boy! He's so slippery! Just like his owner. Give it back! Give it back. That's... Give it back. That's not a key. Sorry. That's not your pendant either. Were they family? No. It was all just a dream, wasn't it? But one day? No. Time to wake up and forget. Six months ago. On that day, Corneo picked her as a bride, and on the next, she vanished without a trace. But before she did, she gave it back. Salt on the wound. Thing cost me a small fortune. Why did you want to come down here? Revenge. I know I need to let go, but I can't. I need closure, because without it, I'll never be able to move on. It's fine. As long as you get us topside, we're still in. 
Thanks. And don't worry. I got you. <sighs> you all right? I know a shortcut. Follow me. That twisted piece of shit. I'm gonna enjoy beating him to a pulp. Corneo's mine, and mine alone. Huh? Please. Fine. Coming through. Out of our way. Let me handle this. Take that. I got this. All right. Okay then. Y'all think we got everything? Question is, now what? It's not gonna be easy selling this stuff. Oh, I know. What about Marl? We could ask her to help. I'm sure she'd be happy to.
Wait outside. Think the kid's gonna be okay going it alone? It's Leslie! Got some urgent info for the Don! <laughs> Come alone? Of course. Really? Without my little avalanche kittens? I thought I told you to round them up and bring them to me. Actually, it's them I came to talk about. Hmm. Uh. I need to remind you why I'm down here. Spilling the beans to those three escape artists was a serious mistake. And now I'm on Shinra's shit list. The plate stunt was meant to be an unprecedented tragedy, claiming countless innocent lives. But those naughty little kittens organized an evacuation and screwed up the plan. <sighs> I'll let you in on a secret. Chinra is going to abandon Midgar and build something close to paradise. I was invited to be a part of it. Dawn of a new and improved wall market! I'll be lucky to live another week. <sighs> Leslie. I was gonna let you run your own place. Give you a piece of the action. What a shame. Pop quiz time, kiddo! <laughs> Villains like us only divulge our evil plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation, hmm? When you think you've already won. <laughs> Goodbye. Think again, Don. Huh? It's you. You were talking about the Sector 7 plan. Keep talking, asshole. Ah! Over there! Over there, look! Don't try to bullshit us. But that's the thing. It's not technically bullshit when it's true. Uh. <laughs> 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 Feel free to play with your food. Donna. Bastard. First him, then Corneo. Take the lead. Not bad. Come on, again. It's on you. Let's do this. Get around the world and 
Gotta step it up. You okay? Where's Cornell? Sorry, bastard got away. Uh, it's fine. I'll track him down eventually. Not like I have anything better to do. You know, I wouldn't be so sure about that. She could still be out there. Can never be sure how much someone means to you till they're gone. Don't give up on her yet. Was it a message? What was she trying to tell me? <clears throat> we'll meet again. It's a symbol of reunion.
Then I guess I've got no choice but to find her first. Hmm. <laughs> Thanks. Hold up. I think you might be forgetting something. I haven't. Found it. Let's get out of here. And then I'll give you what you need. That sweet Midgar small. <laughs> this way. <sighs> Grappling guns. You can practically fly with the souped up motors on these babies. Sector 7 is on the other side of that wall. The guns will get you over and past it, along with any number of other obstacles. But, they're one-way tickets. So once you start up, there's no coming back. You should probably get your affairs in order, just in case. Thank you. Didn't tell you before, but we're looking for someone, too. That right. Hope you find them. You too. What brings you here? Gifts from an angel. They're to be used to help the people of Sector 7 rebuild. The angel of the slums? You didn't meet her, did you? Tell me, what was she like? Never met her. Just her go-between. A shame. Oh, bless her sweet soul. I don't know what to say. I'll make sure the funds are put to good use. Here. Why don't you take this? Something tells me you can use it more than me. Should we go back to the shelter? All right. <laughs> now that that's been taken care of, things are looking a lot better around here.
ready to do this? Once we start up that wall, we won't be coming back here anytime soon. So, when this is over, you gonna go on being a merc? That's the plan. Reckon it suits you? Yeah, it does. Used to think you were a little shit with a big attitude and a bigger inferiority complex. Quite possibly the worst person I have ever met. But that was before I figured you out. All this, it ain't you. Deep down, you're a pretty nice guy. Didn't see it when we were kids, but... Don't know about any of that. But kindness is no use on the battlefield. If anything, it's a liability. Hey, no one's asking you to treat Shinra with kid gloves. <sighs> Aerith's up there waiting for us. Then we better get a move on, huh? Ready?